Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Michelle, and today I have my Mint Mongoose package for March. Okay, so Mint Mongoose is a jewelry subscription. You can get like a jewelry little jewelry set subscription. And it is $16.99 a month. You get a three-piece jewelry set. And you can customize it whether you want silver, gold, rose gold, or a mix. Um, what else? You can get, usually you can get earrings. You can opt for no earrings. They'll send necklaces, bracelets, rings, earrings. Um, but like some people don't have their ears pierced, so they just say no earrings. And then you can add stuff on. So, and I didn't I fully realize this before. I thought you could just add on your first order, which I had done when I first ordered. So, if you want to add on a surprise earrings just for your first order, it's $4.99. Or you can add on an extra set of earrings, and it'll be a surprise. So, it won't necessarily match the set um, for $3.99 each box or bag, or a surprise ring for each one would be $3.99, or a t-shirt would be $9.99. Um, so, let's open this up. I had, they kind of changed things up. When I first got this, it was a four-piece set, and they even had watches, which I never, I opted out of watches, but they changed it up, and they added the t-shirt, and so, um, my subscription that I had paid for went to the, you know, the regular three piece and then they added the, the t-shirt on it. I do like their t-shirts. So when you open this package, this is how it comes. Everything's all wrapped inside the t-shirt. The t-shirts are very soft, very good quality t-shirts. Um, uh, I'm very happy with them. The only thing is, is I don't really wear this kind of shirt all the time. So... I don't think in the future I will, like once I change up my subscription or once my subscription's over, I don't think I will uh, get the t-shirt anymore just because I just don't wear it, I'm finding. So I feel like I'm almost wasting it, you know, but they're really nice t-shirts. Okay, so this, and there's a new theme every month. So this month the t-shirt says, make it a glass half full kind of day. And they had asked me like what size, and so I think I requested large in the t-shirts, um, and they fit true to size. Um, they're very, like a very soft cotton. I think they're hundred percent cotton, right? Oh no, sixty percent cotton, forty percent polyester. Very very soft, nice, very comfortable, nice t-shirts. Um, okay, I wear mine usually like to bed. So then they always give you a Werther's Original candy. And this month they pop this in there. Sometimes, I think every like three months, they used to do something where every three months you got like a little extra something, like a little gift. So this month is this little clip. Now, to be honest, this is not really something I would wear, but it is cute. I'm just not really like a clip. I'm not really a pearl kind of girl. <laughs> But this will be cute in my daughter's hair. Little clip. And then, this is how the package comes. So, oh, okay, it says, Magical Mongoose Happy Three Month Aversary. We're good together. In, celebrating, in celebration of months and months of a good thing, we have included a bonus goodie in this box just for you. We hope you enjoy it and look forward to many more months of our shiny teal packages in your mailbox. See you again in three months for another celebration of our friendship. So, I mean, it's not like, it's it's not, it's, it's an inexpensive little gift, but it's fun to get like a little something. I've gotten clips before, I've gotten like little pins. Um, I've got, uh, one time I got a cute little baggy, like a, little, I don't know if it's a gift bag. What did I do with that? I think I gave it to my little one, but, so it's just fun. Every time uh, she has a postcard, a lot of the postcards are just beautiful and I hang them on the wall. And then on the back, it shows everything in the box or, you know, what's coming this month. And then there's also like a letter. So I'm going to read the letter. I'm going to cover because I don't really want to see what's in there. So our inspiration. She writes, hi there. This month's set is inspired by the glass half full mentality. The set. 
It takes absolutely no effort to see the obstacles in front of us, at the challenges life throws our way, and the summits we have to climb to reach what's on the other side. This is the most this is most often because the negatives in this life are usually associated with pain. When you think or <laughs> I can't read today. When you have a splinter, you don't feel the nine fingers that are kicking butt and taking names. You feel the one that has that little piece of wood raining on the whole parade. I designed this set to resemble the truth of life that when there is one thing working against you or causing pain, resembled by the small pendant on the first layer of the necklace, there are eight things working for you. The large bottom pendant is meant to remind us that although not always easy, remembering to help, remembering to keep a glass half full mentality is one of the most beneficial things you can do for yourself. I wanted this set to scream a visualization of all the good, amazing things we have going for us so that in the dark times, we may remember the goodness that so vastly outweighs the negatives. For every one negative working against us, there are eight or more positives cheering us on, pushing us forward, and painting our days a beautiful color. Although it's a small example and rather humorous, in comparison to my more serious content mentioned here, my daughter's complete hatred towards tomatoes is what's pushing me to make this set. <laughs> Anytime we put them on her plate, freak out. However, it didn't take, uh, sorry, my, I got distracted there. However, it didn't take too many implications that tomatoes were delicious brother loves them and mommy loves them before she gave them another try while they still aren't her favorite veggie she's uh changing her perspective towards them has helped tremendously we have that same power within ourselves changing our perspectives i hope you enjoy this set and join me in kicking the glass half empty mentality to the curb and that's helen the smiling face behind the mongoose um i love her little messages they're always uplifting and positive and I just think it's uh, I think it's fantastic okay so let's open this up and see what this month is all about Whoop. so we've got our three pieces here um, and that's, by the way, what she's saying, I fully believe that because I feel like, I remember when I was younger, I would say, oh, I'm going to be sick. I'm going to be sick. I remember like getting ready from school, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, even in high school. Oh, I'm going to be sick today. I'm going to be sick. I feel like crap, you know? And then all of a sudden I start feeling sick. And then as I got older, oh, this is totally different. As I got older... I started realizing that you tell yourself you're gonna be sick, you're sad, you're negative, you're going to be. But if you tell yourself, you're okay, I'm okay, I'm a fighter, I'm good, I'm gonna be okay. And I mean, yeah, obviously, if you have the flu, you have the flu. But it really helps mentally. And I think a lot, I think it's hard for a lot of people, and I'm not saying it's that simple, but I have had days where I've just felt so down, and I didn't have a reason. It wasn't that someone died or you know there was something major going on it was just I was feeling just down that day and I remember just sitting there thinking no I'm gonna be I'm gonna have a good day I'm not gonna let whatever it is get me down I'm gonna be happy I'm gonna have a good day and I just kept telling myself that and I ended up having a better day this is so tangled um so I feel there's power in that you know I guess I could just un... Okay. I don't know how they got this so tangled in here. But it is... These, um, I've said this in past boxes, but if this is the first time you're watching, they always have extenders on their necklaces, which I really like. So, because I, you know, sometimes you want something short, sometimes you want something long, and this is still... Okay, anyways, this is the necklace. This is so different. Um, so it's got like a big disc and then two, four, six, eight smaller things here. Let me see. It's 
small little round discs, I guess. And you can put it on like this. It's cute. That's actually really cute. I would not have picked this out in the store, but it is very cute. Okay, then this looks like it matches because I can see the little round discs in here. And I love that she creates the jewelry herself. I don't know where she comes up with all these ideas for every month, you know? Oh, they're earrings. Okay, so then you got earrings to match. Oh, these are kind of hard to get in and out. I don't know, maybe not. Well, alrighty then. <laughs> Whoops. It's the hole. Okay. So there's the earring. These are cute, little dangly earrings. And then, let's see what's on this side. Oh, it has the little discs too. So, and then there's just another, same thing has the extender, and it's just a single little dot. And this one moves around. So, whereas like a set, this one higher. Oops, I did not clip that right. I really hope you can't hear my son playing his video games. He is so loud. <laughs> I cannot get this. I'm usually pretty good at putting on necklaces. There we go. I think I got some hair in that one too. So there's the. So that's cute. This would even be. I, I kind of even think this would be really cute to put like up like this, like more up on higher on your neck. Um, and excuse my neck, when I wear jewelry that's not real, that happens. But it's all dots. This is really cute. So this is a fun month. Um, so yeah, that's it. This is this month's. And this is kind of usually what we get. Usually like two necklaces, an earring, or there'll be a bracelet. Um, and like here, let's see, she kind of shows it all together and you could have gotten it rose gold, silver, or gold. And that's it. All right guys, let me know what you think. I kind of like it. I'm trying to figure out what I could wear with. Maybe it's just something simple. Not necessarily this top, although I don't think it looks horrible either. Like, I think it's, I don't know, it's fun. I used to love to wear necklaces like this when my kids were younger um, because they'd play with them. When we go, like my son, like I'd go like to church, he would sit there and it would keep him occupied playing with whatever long necklace. So I always wore like long necklaces so he'd sit there and play with it and it kept him occupied. Um, anyways, all right guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm curious what you guys think about this uh, little set and the subscription. And have a beautiful day.